Hey guys, BradM73 here. Welcome back to Farming Simulator 22. As always, don't forget to like, share, comment, and please subscribe for this and many more videos. Also, shameless plug, uh, I will be using my Toby Eye Tracker in this episode, and if you want to pick up your own Toby Eye Tracker and save 5%, use my uh, referral code, or my referral link, actually, down in the video description. And then, when you check out, use BradM73 as your discount code for that extra 5% off and uh, massive thanks to everybody who does that um, it's absolutely it's actually a really cool accessory for your your PC I have been really impressed with it um, not only in farming simulator but star citizen and a bunch of other games and uh, I definitely recommend uh, a Toby eye tracker if you want to up your game um, let's see. Speaking of upping my game, I need, I need to figure out what... Oh, gosh. I've totally forgotten. Okay. Um, well, not... Not totally. Just mostly. <laughs> uh, let's see. Yeah, we gotta pick up from where I, I left off in the last episode. So, we're doing that right meow. We've got tons of, okay, we've got some things we gotta do here. We just gotta do it. So, wait, did I want to go big bag? It's gonna be a big bag. Okay, eighteen twenty for a thousand. Yeah, big bag, big bag and it's the way we need to be going. Fill that up. Oh. We do have a bailing contract. Oh, this is drying it with a tether and bailing. Should I do it? I just don't know. Wait, what field was it? 13? Is that a small field? I think that's a pretty small field. I guess we could go and accept this contract. Take the bail. Let's see. Dry it. I think I need to borrow the equipment. Yeah, we need to de decouple this. And I'm going to just leave the front weight out here. Oh my gosh, am I gonna sneeze? I feel like I'm gonna sneeze. I I hate when I start recording and then I'm like, oh, I've got to sneeze, by the way. <laughs> That's never fun. All right. So I'm gonna send this tracker. I'm gonna send him way up here. And then while we've got this guy out here, yeah, I'm totally not gonna get these other, oh, it's a black voucher. That, this voucher looks kind of key. We've got to get the tether, the wind rower, and the baler, oh great. Oh, but we don't need the round baler, thankfully. I think I've got to, Gotta turn right here. Yep. I don't know if I've driven one of these vouchers yet. This is kind of nice. Okay, clear right and left. Let's go ahead and turn the uh, cruise control on. Do 
do do do do do do do do do do do do do This actually, this job is not going to take very long. I don't think. And I'm going to drive, I think I already got it, but I'm just going to drive in here really quick. I want to make sure, yep, I already got the, uh, <clears throat> the collectible back there. I'm gonna drive back here to this farm too, because I there is a collectible up here. I can't remember I can't remember if there's one or two. I know that there's at least one. Riverside or no, River Rock Estate. Okay. There should be a collectible. I think it sits on the edge there, but yeah, we must have we must have gotten this one before. All right, so what I'm going to do here, I'll decouple that. And then we're going to have to drive back and get all the rest of the equipment. Okay, there comes the mower. Man, he got up here fast. Taking the racing lane on the inside. Okay, AI worker has completed his task. So what we're gonna do now, we're sending him to get the uh, wind rower. And I'm gonna see, I don't think I can, but I'm gonna see if it might be possible to attach the baler to the back of the wind rower. And again, I don't think it is, but we're going to find out. Oh, what I could do, which would save a little bit of time. All right, here we go. In the moment of truth. Uh. Nope. All right. So let's go set his destination. My mouse is like really sensitive today. So are my emotions. Okay, so here. <laughs> Um, uh, yeah, let's, let's just drop this off and then we'll bring this guy up here. have him drive like rat cheer all right so let's go ahead whoops
Yep, so we're just gonna go around here like this. a little bit there we go I want to try to get as much of this grass in here as I can get because if we have any overage then we can just um, you know sell that or we'll, we'll be able to keep it for ourselves actually well I guess we'll want to sell it actually yeah we're gonna want to sell that Because this is going to be hay, I think. Hey, hey, hey. Uh oh, see, we're missing some spots cutting here. So I'm gonna, oh gosh. So we're gonna send him back to the field. Whoops. I'm just gonna put him like right cheer. And then we gotta pick up the tether. Now, another thing, ooh, I might actually need to windrow this into the field, but we're gonna see. Whoops. No, no, no. Did it actually work? Okay, I think it did. It, it is getting into the field there, so that's good. All right. Kind of worried that it's going a little bit too far out of the field now and the uh, wind rower might not be able to reach it. That would be bad for us. <laughs> oh gosh. Can I? I uh, can. Yeah. So yeah, let's kind of go like this. That should kind of kick it backwards a little bit. I think we'll probably be okay. Uh-oh, helper B is blocked by an object. The A worker D, the D. Oh. I think it's okay now, let's see here. Okay, helper B is there. Yeah, we're all right, we're, we're just fine. We're all fine here. <laughs> what movie is that from? All right. Whoops. All 
All right, windrower time. This is where we put all the grass in a nice, neat row, hopefully. This is actually a pretty nice sized windrower. Like when I first started using it, I was not really, I was kind of concerned that it was smaller than it actually is. <laughs> That's what she said. But um, it's, it's pretty good. Okay, worker B has completed its task. So now we're gonna have to bring up the the bailing trailer. Okay, right here. This is what I was talking about. Okay, we're good. We're good. All right. Pick this up. And we'll just move right down through here and we will be all finished with the rowing of the winds. <laughs> nope. Um, let's see. Let's start this guy up. I'm just going to drive him forward a little bit. We're going to drop off the baler. Because I honestly, I want this guy to just go back to the dealer. So we can... Um, you know, get thing... You know, he can pick up the whatever he needs to pick up. All right, so he's there. Let's go here. All right, awesome. It looks like our seating is finished. We're gonna have to purchase a roller. Ugh. Okay, where is my big bale trailer? Like, I honestly, I'm not, I don't know where I left it. It's gotta be over at the main farm. Ooh, this, my tracker needs washed. Oh, oh watch out, dear. Oh, dear. Where is the big bale? Oh, there it is, right over there, okay. Well, we're gonna take care of that. But I really want a quick wash. Much better.
Okay. So we're going to see what happens here. Um, we're just going to send him like right there. Is he going to turn around? No, I don't think so. All right. What? We weren't even remotely lined up with it. Okay. That was pretty fail. Okay. I can't remember if this one automatically ejects the bale or if we have to manually do it. I guess we'll find out in just a moment. Gotta be kind of have to be careful with the bales because we're on a slight slope here, so they're gonna want to run roll downhill. So We might end up getting a lot more money out of this than I'm expecting. This will be interesting. Okay, I'm gonna come to a complete stop. Perfect. And then I'm not even sure if we're going to be able to, to eject this bale, which will be very unfortunate. Yeah, we're not even going <laughs> to... We're not even going to be... Okay. Um, so we have to... The Johnson's Farmer's Market. Where the heck is that? Is that... Is that it? Okay. Gonna tag this. Well, this kind of sucks because I ended up doing all of the. All of the extra grassing stuffing you know, things. That's eh, all right. Okay, so I'm gonna have this guy head over to the Johnson's Family Market, uh, which is right here. And we'll go ahead and, oh wait, let's, let's fast forward time by about 240%. Let's also look at the shop. Okay, nothing's 
too exciting is here. We just got into some rain. Not sure what's going on with the roads here. So that job is still active. Oh, that was a quick rainstorm. All right, let's see how we're doing. Still just the one job. Uh-oh. What about... No, nothing, ex nothing too exciting here. Ooh, ooh. Okay, we got the... I think... I don't know if it was the last episode or the episode before. We got the collectibles over there. We got the collectibles underneath this bridge here. I'm going to run up to the Oak Hollow Caves State Park. And there's some collectibles up here. I think there's one right here, which is a horse. <clears throat> I can't remember if there's any others around here. Doo -doo -doo. Oh. Okay, so here's this area. If we go up this direction, through the private property sign. Trail, this trail crosses private property, blah, blah, blah. Okay. I know that there's at least two here. There's one right out here. I think it's a horse. Yes, it is. So we've only got two more horses to find. Um... Let's see, there's one over here. Rachir. It's a tractor, I think. Yep. And I don't think, contrary to popular belief, I don't think there's any more up here. That's a neat little birdhouse on the side there. Even though you can get up and walk around on the house. Now, there is going to be one up on top of the... Uh, the search tower here. Oh, there's three of them, I think, over in the barn. So we'll try to clear all these out. I think an episode or two ago, we also found the one in the center of the, uh, the maze here. So I don't know. I don't know if we're going to get any big chunks of cash right now, but that surely would help. I would love to be able to buy a new combine. Or just pay my loan off, though. The, yep, here's a tractor. The loan is not a huge priority right now. Oh, look at the pretty view. Look at... There's up north. There's out that way. Uh, I can't see where my tractor is. Okay, Worker D has completed his task. Yeah, we need to go right here. And oh my gosh, that you know, we'll eventually search the caves. I don't think I'm going to do that in this episode just to kind of keep the ball rolling. I don't want to make this, I don't want to make this episode all about you know making tons of money, um, even though that's always nice. <laughs> I think there's three of them. I know that there's at least two. One of them is right in here. Right here. So we, there's a plow. That one took me a long time to find. 
Um, I can't. Seems like there's one. There's one down. <laughs> I can see it right there. I keep thinking there's one up on the rafters here, but... It's been a long, long time since I played this game. Okay, so there's this one. Was there another one? Is there another one in the brush here? Maybe there wasn't. Maybe it was just these two. Man, something though is like telling me, no, Brad, there were three. Nothing in there. Um. I'm just like looking up on the rafters and I'm not seeing anything. Oh, we need to slow down time. Yeah, maybe it was just the... Maybe I was thinking of the, the tractor up there being kind of like the third one in this area. Even though there were kind of four. All right. I should just be able to pull right up here and then eject that. Boom, boom. Yeah, we got an extra $2,200. What the heck? Minus 9,000 blah, blah, blah. Transported for field 13. Okay. That is a new bug. Um, so... Oh man, that really sucks. Ooh, field 30, fertilizing. Yes, I will 100% take that job. Because I don't think we're going to be able to finish this bailing job. Uh, honestly, though, I think that's the first bailing job that I'm not going to be able to complete. Because of a bug. I don't recall having that problem. I mean, like, negative... Wow. That was a big number. I'm gonna. Ha I might actually have to go back and like try to remember where in the video that was, so I can report it to Giants. Cause that's not right. Well, now I'm not sure what exactly to do about the whole. Um, bailing issue we're just gonna have him go and there's no way I don't think there's any way for me I mean, that should have completed the job, because look. See, it's like 100%. So this job is bugged for sure. Nan? Hey, Nan. All right. I'm just going to have to cancel it. Yeah, that really sucks. Because that could have been some decent money. Contract on field 13 fit. Well, we got a little bit of money for it, but not nearly as much.
Come on, bro. You can do it. Do it, bruh. Do it, bruh. Come on, bruh. Don't stop. Don't stop. Make it pop. I know. Don't be disappointed, guys. Yes! I know I failed it. You don't have to rub it in. They don't need to rub it in. <sighs> Nothing new there. Oh, I wanted to come over here. <clears throat> I think I got this Easter egg too, but I'm going to check again. Is that it? I think we got it. Yeah, I think there's an Easter egg right up here. Okay. Then there's some more up in the woods here. Oh, wait. We're not even near the woods. <laughs> we got to go through the sawmill area. To which there are no Easter eggs. I don't think there's any in here. I remember looking through here like a million times during a live stream, and I'm pretty sure there's nothing at all up in here. Nothing at all up in here, up in here, up in here. Oh, it's gonna be right over here. Seeing this, um, if you look at the map, You'll see there's like this road that I'm going to. I'm kind of going to the end of the road. Um, there are two collectibles right here at the end of the road. It's a horsey and a wagon. So two more trailers, one more horse. And I don't think there's any more down here. Like, I, I always think that there's going to be one down here, and there never is. Never. But there is, if we go down towards the river, there's one on the br uh, bridge down here, which, hilariously enough, I don't know if it's really that hilarious, but I must have walked past this thing a gazillion times. And I want to say I got it on, on this Let's Play. We might have stopped and gotten it. It's like right out here. Oh, no, there it is. I must have driven past this thing 1,400 times. And then I don't think there's any down underneath here. All right, AI worker has completed the task. Um, did we complete? No, we did not. So let's start you up. Uh, let's look at the field and see what is, actually remains to be fertilized. Yeah, okay. We're just going to go here until we're finished. Contract finished. All right, so at least we'll be able to get paid for that. That'll be kind of a nice chunk of change. The other thing I want to do is I want to come over here and fertilize field, uh, field number 50. Oh, we got some eggs out there.
See, like right here, I can fertilize this. Now, I've had a bunch of people say that you can use a roller on this or something. And I guess there's like a special roller that you can use for grass. Uh, the only downside is to that particular roller is it's narrow. And... And it takes longer than just using fertilizer. So, yeah. And I should just be able to fertilize straight around all this stuff. Yep, no problem. so far okay just gonna hire the worker here um oh collect that job uh let's go and fast forward time once again okay there's 1800 hours Okay, so just the Fent left. Any jobs, no contracts. I keep hitting the wrong button when I do that. <laughs> I don't know why this guy is doing what he's doing. Oh, this is gonna be painful. Why is he re-fertilizing all this? Do I even need to fertilize that? See, I don't even need to fertilize that. Maybe like... I don't know what the heck he's doing. There's no need to fertilize any of this. All right, so here's the, where we need to do the rolling. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, no, slow down, slow down, slow down. Oh man, we are so close. Um, I don't even know if we're gonna have enough time. No, drop that off, drop it off. Because we actually do have to roll this part of the field. All right, um, and we got to do it quickly. Let's see. Yes. I'm just gonna eventually have to buy a roller. Maybe next season. Maybe later. So we are going to be racing back. Oh, look at the beautiful nighttime. It is really nice when when the moon is out on a really bright summer night out in the country and you get to see everything for miles. It is really pretty. Okay, I am trying to get back to the field as fast as possible. Because I think, you know what, I've never, I have yet in this, in Farming Simulator 22, gone from one month to the next, next month, what am I trying to say? From one month to the next month, um, just being in the normal game world like this. 
So, yeah, all right. Start unfurling, unfolding, whatever. Alright, so we're going to turn up this way. Nice. Okay, cool. There goes the train again. Training on his train and a train, train, train. in there. Ooh, fertilizing jobs. Gonna accept that contract. Okay. Field 33, 75, and 81. So field 33, um, 85, or 75 and 81. Okay. So, all right. So we're just going to go and get on the highway, I guess. I, I'm really going to need to start looking for a vehicle to replace this Massey Ferguson. I kind of would like a new Massey Ferguson. that has the same horsepower, but a higher top speed. But I still want, you know, the same, I want a smaller tractor. I don't want a massively big tractor. Hit our cruise control there. Gonna be way off in the distance there. Okay, here's field thirty three coming up. Gold Crest Valley. Boom. All right. So we got that going on. He's still rolling in here.
Oh no, we have to lime this too. <gasps> dun, dun, dun. Uh, I don't even know what to do. Do we have enough money to buy a fertilizer spreader? See, this one can do lime. Well, actually, once we're done... Once we're done with the spraying contracts, we should have enough. I think, oh gosh, it's like so dark here. I think we need to take this guy in for a wash. He also needs a refill of seed and fertilizer. Needs a wash, definitely. I wonder if I sell this, I wonder how much I'll be able to sell it for. Even fully cleaned and repainted, I wonder how much I'll be able to sell it for. I don't know. The repainting prices in this game are freaking ridiculous. All right, owned items, cedars. So 56,496. Um, where are, okay, cedars. So this is what we have right now. If we went to a the uh, coon, I think all we get is more um, seed and fertilizer storage. Crops are the same. <clears throat> it's got a slightly faster operating speed at 10 miles an hour as opposed to nine. So that's a 10% increase there. Um, but the, the width is the same. Um, it's heavier. We would still be able to use it. Um, this one has less. This one also, the Vader stat also does not do fertilizing. But if I'm going to buy this, I might as well just buy this. This is kind of going to be my dream. My dream cedar. Um, also, let's see. Let's look at... All right, first of all... Um, let's see. Medium tractors. We've got the Massey Fur... Oh, gosh, no. So this one's 170 horsepower. And let's just make sure... Is he done? Is he done? <gasps> all right. Field 75. Let's go. Whoops. All 
Okay, he's driving. So basically, we just need a medium tractor that does 175 horsepower. Um, we actually have the Massey Ferguson 7820, no, 6700, sorry. This is what we have right here. So it's just straight 170 horsepower. So even if we got this, let's see. So right now, base is, um, let's see, 160. So we could go to 175 horsepower for 134,000 and up to 200 for 147,000, which is 100,000 more than we have right now. Uh, I'm thinking, and it's hurting. <sighs> um, part of me... Part of me truly wonders... Oh, are we done here? Are we done? Are we all done over here? Okay, so now field 51 just needs to be... Let's see. Whoops. Let's return that. Oh my gosh, we've only got six minutes. So I'm pretty sure that this guy is going to be the next one I go with. This one right here. Now we could go, oh no, not that one. Not this one, not this one. Because there's no engine options on him. There might be on this one. Nope. And then if we went to, yeah, see, then we're going straight up to the 6R series. Um, if we go with a small tractor like the John Deere 6M, the biggest engine uh, is only 140 horsepower. And look how dinky this thing looks. Like this one will probably be an okay one for just doing... Um, like fertilizing, but I'm not sure that I would really want to do anything else with this, especially with such a low horsepower rating. So, yeah, I don't know. All right, let's see what we got. Is he down here yet? Yes. <clears throat> let's do, let's try to get these two fertilizing jobs done. We've only got like five minutes to do them both. And then field 81, I think, is that really narrow, where is it? It's the really narrow field. So I'm going to go down. We're going to go over here, do that one really quick, because it's going to be shorter, you know, just coming down here, going like this, and then back up, instead of going down here, and then coming all the way back down there. Get, you see what I'm getting at? See? Do you see? Do you see? You might not see, for all I know. Ooh, look, we are almost out of fertilizer. But this, this field's literally gonna take less than 20 seconds to do. I don't know, I'm not counting seconds. Does anybody wanna count seconds? All right, and the job is complete. So somebody calculate 
When I started fertilizing to when the contract was finished, how many seconds? Put it down in the video description right now. I want to know. So I don't know what's going to happen again. Um, we've got, okay, so this one's completed. This one's going to be completed. Oh no. And I don't know what's, whoops. I don't know what's going to happen with the fertilization, with the liming. How, I don't know. Does liming matter on grass? Contract on field 75 finished. Ooh, we got a nice thunderstorm. I like it. I love I love the sound of thunderstorms. Does anybody not love? I know like some people get anxiety, but I freaking love it. Yeah, so this is gonna grow into grass in about two sec two minutes. Might as well um Let's see what happens. Okay, it's 23.59. Oh, well maybe, maybe. Let's go, let's go to, oh, no, nope, there's the grass. Okay. So I don't know what's gonna happen with the lime. So we've got grass mow. I mean, we can mow all this grass, but I don't want to. Um, here is the yep, vehicle leasing costs, all that fun stuff, loan interest. So we've got like, you know, $3,000 of expenses per month. Well, just for that day with the vehicle leasing costs. But all, everything is now ready to seed. Um, now here's the next problem. Which isn't really a problem, it's just a... Oh man, I love... I can just sit here and listen to this for an hour. I, I literally could. Alright. Let's uh, turn off all the lights. Now, if I sleep... Is it gonna... Oh man, this is... This is a big risk. I'm gonna wait until I think I'm gonna wait until the next episode, and we're gonna we're gonna see what happens. All right, well that is gonna be it for me for this episode. We got quite a bit done, made some more money. Um, AI worker G has completed his task, so he should be back at the vehicle dealer. But um, I will see you back for Farming Simulator 22 in the next episode. So for now, don't forget to hit the like button, leave comments, and if you have not done so, slap that like button. It helps me out tremendously. And click the bell icon so you get notified when I post new video content. Well, thanks again for watching. I'm Brad M73. I will see you next time. Bye for now. Oh my gosh. Bye for now. <laughs> I like totally burped in the middle of that. Bye.